Hi guys, it's Taylor, and I'm going to start doing more for my concert series that I've been doing. Um, so today is going to be um, makeup for a concert. Really what I have on today is um, what I'm going to be wearing. It's sort of subtle, not overpowering. It's something just for a concert. So, yeah. And I'm sorry because there's a glare here. That's why I'm blocking. Hope you guys like my shirt. It's pretty cute, right? Yeah. So I'm going to get started. And... I first do my eyes first, so I start out with this Urban Decay eyeshadow primer. Um, it is about $12, I mean, I think it's a bit pricey for a primer, but that's what it looks like on the stick. The stick got a bit bent, but I think it keeps on my makeup a lot longer since I've been using it for the last week, because my sister just got a new one. So yeah, this is pretty good to wear. So, then I'm probably going to just wear one of my nudes. Um... What I've been wearing is the Blush Nude Palette by Maybelline. Um, I've been wearing three colors for like the last two weeks now. Um, I've been wearing one, two, these three colors. They're the they're far right three colors in the palette. I adore these colors. They I think they're good for summer. They're nude. They're light. I think they're pretty cool. And the brush I use is the Real Techniques by Sam and Nick Chapman. Um, these brushes are amazing. I also have another brush I'll be showing in the video. Um, most of these products I've been showing a lot lately, but, um, it's just, uh, overall, sort of. Okay, so next, after I do that, I put on, um, Lash and Brow Gel Mas- Gel- well, okay. Gel Mascara. Um, I do this for my eyebrows so they get dry before I put it on. I think it just helps it. Um, keep your eyebrows positioned. Um, I'll tell you why I could do something with my eyebrows in a bit. Um, okay. So, then I put on mascara. Um, I actually use two different mascaras. One for top and one for bottom. Um, for top I use the Maybelline New York Lash Sensational Effect. Um, this mascara is my favorite mascara at the moment. Um, I use it every single day, no matter what. Um, the brush is on point. It's more for the full fan effect and you really do get the full fan effect. I recommend this highly. Um, I can tell you this is about two or three dollars. I'm not sure because it's my sister's. I keep buying all her stuff. And this is about seven or eight dollars which is pretty good because this has been lasting me the last few months. So, And then my other mascara I use is the Voluminous Miss Manga by I want to say L'Oreal. I think it's L'Oreal. Um, I wasn't a big fan of this for top lashes. For bottom lashes, I think it makes them more full. So, it has a pointy... Not pointy. It has... It bends. So, like, it forms to your eyes. I don't know. But, this was about the same price. Seven or eight dollars as well. Then for, um... My under eye, I use... The Master Cajal by Maybelline New York. In the color... Onyx Rush. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. Oh, it's just... I think it's just black. Um, it just comes on like a stick like this, and it's, it's going to last me a long time. I've had this for like a few months already, and it's perfect for me. I like it. Then I go on to my face. Um, I just got this Rimmel London Stay Matte Primer. This lasts you literally all day. Um, it's, act- it's just white. I could just... You can see. It's just white. Um, it actually is a bit thick when you put it on, but like... It's like sunscreen, actually, as you rub it in. I think it feels like the texture of sunscreen and stuff. So, yeah, I definitely recommend getting this. This is about $7 at my local Ulta. Um, most of these products from, were from Ulta. So, yeah, I put this on my face before any makeup. Except for my eyes, because I put primer on my eyes. Okay, then I go on to my under eyes, because I do know I do have um, dark circles under my eyes. Because, you know... So I go with the uh, Age Rewind Dark Circle Eraser. This stuff is amazing. It does get a bit messy though, as you can see with the cap. It's a bit disgusting, but this is a great product. I don't know what shape this is in. Oh, this is a medium. And I, I just put it like under my eyes like I'm like a football player. But then I use this Beauty Blender. I forget the brand. I just got this. I don't even know the brand of it, but... It's, this was like five bucks. And this was about seven as well. After that, I um, put that in with my beauty blender. 
I then go on to the Maybelline New York Dream, Dream Pure Beauty Cream. Um, in the shade Light Sheer Tint. I don't know. I think that's just the brand name. I mean the tint name. As you can see from here. How it is. This was about the price range of seven or eight dollars as well. I really don't remember the exact price because this makeup is a bit old. So yeah, I use my be my beauty blender to put, uh, blend this in, and it gives me a nice um, little bit of glow and stuff. So yeah. So next, I go on to powder for my face. Powder for my face. I've been using the Revlon Color Stay. This stuff is great. Um, this is the shade light medium, and it's pretty cool. It comes with your own brush if you like, I mean, um, like, pad if you use it. I don't use them. And it has your little mirror inside. I use, um, a Dove brush. The Red Seconds by Nick, by Sam and Nick Chapman. I use this brush every single day. I love it so much. And then after that, I put on this NYX Matte Bronzer. This bronzer really, um, definition, gives definition to your face, I think. I got this in medium. And then onto the eyebrow situation. On camera, you really can't tell, but up here, I do gotta have a scar from my, my cat. Yes, from my cat. So, I use um, the NYC Smooth Skin Liquid Concealer. So, what I do is I put um, concealer on the scar, and then with my beauty blender, I blend that in. And then comes with, I go with, um, the Brow Precise, um, by Maybelline. This helps me, um, okay. This helps me, um, make sure my eyebrow looks like nothing happened to it. And I just put some in on the other eyebrow because I wouldn't want to look stupid having one eyebrow done than the other. So, yeah. And then last but not least, I put on my lipstick. For lipstick, I've been using MAC. I super love MAC. I've been recommending MAC to everyone. Um, so this is the MAC Grip Pencil um, in Deverish. I've been showing this in a lot of my videos. And then the color from Mingo. I love showing this. So I love this color so much. I use it every single day. Okay. And um, both of these, the lip pencil and this, were $16, which is pretty pricey, but it does last you a very long time. So, if I did not mention any of the prices, um, you just ask me down below. Um, I'm going to probably be doing some more concert stuff, hopefully. Um, next week, like I said, I'm going on vacation, so there might not be a video. I'm super sorry if there's not. There might be about, I don't know what, but there might be a video. I don't know. But we'll see. Maybe I'll record one and then put it, post it um, during vacation. I don't know. So we'll see. I hope you guys like this concert uh, makeup tutorial. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.